Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to Audio Tips. In today's tutorial, we're going to talk to you guys a bit about a Waves plugin called the GTR Tool Rack. We're going to go into it. We're going to open it up. Uh, we're going to see what kind of options this plugin has to offer. Uh, we're going to do a little overview on it. You know, uh, basically get you guys on the same page that I am. You know, if you're new to Logic uh, Pro and you you have just installed Waves, I'm sure you guys had to open this up. Uh, show you guys how it can benefit you guys. Basically, uh, we're gonna go into audio effects. We're gonna go down to audio units to waves. We're gonna go up to GTR tool rack. We're gonna click on it. It's gonna open up something that looks a little something like this. Um, uh, keep in mind that you have to have certain waves bundles in order to open some of these plugins that I'm opening. But this is basically uh, the GTR tool rack. Again, gives you presets like the like the. Like the stomp, like the stomp uh, plugins, but it also gives you a tempo. It can sync it. You can uh, tap it to find the tempo. You can stomp, amp, tune it. It gives you basically, uh, it's basically the full tool rack for a guitar. This is the optimum tool. Uh, it's probably the best thing you can get. If you guys just want a quick mix, use the other ones. But if you guys want a full mix on a guitar and make it sound real, real crazy, this is what you use. You got your input knobs and your output knobs. But this is basically the best of all the uh, GTR tools. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I suggest you guys try it out. Uh, you know, see what kind of effects you guys can get. It. It's the best way to learn until I uh, show you guys a future video of me actually using the plugin. But this is it. This is the GTR tool rack. Thank you guys for watching, and uh, please subscribe.